About 10 years ago, the African country of Djibouti nearly succeeded in wiping out malaria. Then suddenly the disease roared back. Cases soared from 27 in 2012 to more than 73,000 in 2020. That's a lot of cases for a country of only 1 million people. It was all because of this little pest, a highly invasive mosquito from South Asia. This mosquito is one of the biggest threats in the effort to eliminate malaria because it's resistant to most insecticides and it thrives in urban areas. We were hoping to have no more malaria and to be opening to the tourism, to investment, and having this spike was just a nightmare. The biggest we have ever seen in, in Djibouti. Anopheles tefesai is the name of the new vector, and it is having completely different habit than the, the ones we used to have in Djibouti. This one adapted to the urban, living outside, biting outside, and is adapting faster than us. The government of Djibouti teamed up with the company Oxitec to pursue an innovative approach to malaria control. Oxitec is a biotechnology company and we are the pioneers in using mosquitoes to fight mosquitoes. We insert two small genes into the mosquito's genome and that allows us to release male mosquitoes that seek out and mate with wild type females all of the female progeny from that mating die, thereby reducing the number of malaria-transmitting female mosquitoes in the environment. Meanwhile, our self-limiting gene is passed down a few additional generations to subsequent male mosquitoes, allowing them to continue to carry the fight out for a limited time before they disappear from the environment. This technology, it will give us more opportunity to eliminate malaria and other vector diseases. Le plus tôt possible, Djibouti doit être free de malaria. C'est une maladie qui pétille et qui a un, un lourd fardeau sur notre communauté. People here are tired of mosquitoes and we have a good community engagement here. So they're really supportive of the solution because they've tried almost everything, every classic intervention and it's still having numbers hiking. Il faudrait qu'on améliore et qu'on propage ce genre de technologies modernes sur les continents, que les risques soient atteignés, qu'il n'y ait pas de propagation sur d'autres mégalobones euh, africains.